And I just got home from the hospital and came across this tweet waiting for the market to open up. I'm going to trade a little bit before I go to bed. But I said this before and I've said it in multiple videos that if you're in one of these countries, that the window to get out is closing. And this tweet makes that very clear for those in the UK. It says, new, it says, vaccination will be required to travel forevermore and young people will not be able to leave the country without it. The UK Transport Secretary Grant Shapps told the BBC. And so for many people, if you wait too long and if you have no intention of taking it, then the reality is, is that you need to get out sooner than later, especially if you're a skilled man or if you're a single individual and you've come to realize that this is not the area that I want to be. I'm not looking to live in a communistic country because this is the route all of the West is going. All of the West is going the route of communism and communism always leads to starvation and violence and death. And it's primarily because the people vote for it. A primary, when you look across the UK, the EU, and America, Canada, what do you see? Social programs. When you look at Canada, what do you see? Everybody praises Canada for free, free health insurance. And in the EU and in the UK, they have massive, uh, they have massive social programs. I've seen so many documentaries talking about the abuse in the system and the socialism always leads to communism and this is why you see all of these uh, leaders this is why you see all of these leaders acting like dictators because this is what this environment breeds socialism always breeds the rise of a dictator and in every one of these nations this is exactly what you see you see the rise of dictatorships known as the great reset this is what basically what many of these individuals have voted for. It's what Americans have voted for. It's what the Can Canadians have voted for because people don't want to take responsibility for their lives and they give up their freedom and they abdicate their freedom and they give it up to government. They say, government, you need to take care of me. You need to provide me with free health insurance. You need to provide me with retirement. You need to provide me with education. You need to provide me with child care. I mean, name it. Look, you need to provide me with unemployment. Just recently, you've seen the extension of the moratoriums where the government is literally robbing houses from landlords to give free rent, free housing to the masses. And this is what they vote for, right? This is what the people vote for. All you saw all year long was cancel rent, right? Cancel rent. People don't want to go to work. We need stimulus checks. Give us money. People do not want to take accountability for their own actions and it always leads to communism the window to get out is closing 